British ambassador in Berlin handed the German government a final note stating that unless we heard from them that they were prepared at once to withdraw their troops from Poland, a state of war would exist between us. I have to tell you now that no such undertaking has been received and that consequently this country is at war with Germany. This is London. Edward Armour reporting. On this, the fourth day since England and France declared war on Nazi Germany, there is grave concern over the fate of Britain's newest, largest and fastest luxury liner, Goliath, which sailed for New York just prior to the outbreak of hostilities. The giant vessel, which is carrying a total of 1,860 passengers and crew, has maintained radio silence since leaving Southampton. Meanwhile, there have been unconfirmed reports of a German wolf pack waiting somewhere in the mid-Atlantic in the hope of intercepting her. However, because of Goliath's speed, in excess of 30 knots, she should have little trouble in eluding any would-be attackers. You're a good worker. You'll do fine. I never did get to thank you proper for putting in the good word for me to the captain like you did. Oh, I thought it was the noose around me neck for sure. Just do your job, Wesker. That's all. ship she could be, Goliath. Wait, hold on a minute. I hear something. Damn, answer it. It's possible they could have reached ambience. Uh, but, I mean, that is uh, equalization with the outside pressure. But I... Uh, it beats me. 337 people? After 40 years? I'll be damned. I think I see a light above us. A light? Come on, up that way. 